Hey y'all, I'm Laura and welcome back to Confident Notions. So, I'm gonna apologize in advance if I'm a little not as energetic, I guess, um, as normal. Do you ever have those like days, weeks, weeks, when everything is just so much, it seems like it's so much harder than it really should be. And you're like, why? This shouldn't be this hard. Why does it have to be this hard? Anyways, I'm not going to go into too many details, but yeah, there's a bug, bug, bleh. sorry. Um, yeah, it started, it's either Tuesday or Wednesday this week. I don't know what happened. I closed the lid to my laptop and the display broke, just completely broke. And so like working from home, especially when your office is many miles away is obviously a little bit difficult. And then I chatted with IT and they're like, oh, sorry, where we have a back order on Macs. So you can use your like external display, like external monitor. But yeah, it means that I have to use my Zoom, my call, my phone for Zoom calls. And anyways, so thank you so much for stopping by. If you aren't a subscriber and you've made it this far through me complaining, you should. <laughs> Anyways, <laughs> if you're not a subscriber, I would totally love to have you here. I promise it's, there's usually better than this. It's usually better. Just not today. So I'm going to jump into it. I've got a Dollar Tree haul. My, my, my house is going on the market next week. There, we had a desitin accident on the carpet the other day. Had to have the carpet cleaners come out today. The paint in the garage doesn't match the walls. But we're going on the market. So, I gotta clean out this room. Part of that is this Dollar Tree haul. Two minutes in. All right, let's see what we got here. So, I, of course, went to Dollar Tree, right? And I'm sorry, I'm just like digging around in here and doing all kinds of stuff. So let's get into this bag first. Um, I found something here and I thought this was really cute and it must be older because I've never seen it before. And it's this really cute little, pardon my nails too, I have an appointment tomorrow. Um, it's a sticky note set and it's got like a little lipstick and a shoe and a, is that a dress? That's a dress. And that's so cute in there. It seemed older. I'd never seen it before. So I picked up one of those because why not? Who doesn't need another notepad? Then I found this really cute, again, notebook this is from like the the fun fun zone or whatever the heck they call it and it says donut even and it has this cute little i think is this velcro yeah there's like a velcro flap over here it's a 60 pages i think it's is it lined does it tell you it looks lined i think i see lines in there so it's a super cute little flap and you open it up it's a little spiral bound notebook why not right it's cute is cute. Wait, you can see my notes. There we go. My notes on my whiteboard. Oh, they did not have those. Yeah. Sorry, as I talk to myself. So the Dollar Tree that I went to, the one that's closest to my house, they had their fall stuff out and their fall decor, right? So, you know, they're not in the same bag because why would it be in the same bag? All right, some of the stuff that I got yesterday is in the car and some of it is here. And of course there are similar things that are together. So I picked up actually three of these, but these these pumpkins with the letters on them. So they have them in this like rustic-y wood color and the white and the first in, in the initials. And then they also had it in an orange, but neither the orange nor the brown had all three letters that we needed. So I actually ended up getting two of the orange ones and two of these ones. And I figured whichever one I find the missing four first will be good. I like these ones better, so I'm on the lookout. So here's Kevin for my husband and the L for me, and I'm looking for an M in this, but I found an M in the orange just in case. So I think these are really cute little decor pieces. I mean, they're plasticky, but they're cute. Isn't that cute, that little burlapy thing on it and the, the, the laurel stuff on it? Look at me, talking decor. So cute, I, I really like this. So I'm definitely on the lookout for the M. I bet, fingers crossed, I find that one. Um, 
oops, it's yesterday's coffee and today's coffee. They also had these really cute, like really simple cut out glitter pumpkins again with this little um, raffia, raffia, raffia uh, bow on the top. And this one says pumpkin kisses and harvest wishes on it, which I wasn't a big fan of the color. They had several other colors there, but I didn't like the sayings on those um, very much. So this one is, I like the gold glitter and I think, I think that's corn down there or maize. I wouldn't call it corn, right? So I thought that was nice um, for that one. So I picked up one of this because it's fall decor. I mean, let's be real, I'm gonna buy fall decor. Then they also had two versions of this and um, still got the hot glue on it. Some factory hot glue. So uh, this one is Hello Fall, cute little wooden-y thing with like chipboard um a lot of them have glue all over the place which is fine but it's just like really nice like printed burlap and it's got glitter on it i mean come on it's like a pumpkin and glitter and burlap and yes 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 we're gonna do that um it definitely has a lot of it's got a lot of hot glue left on there it looks like i made it with the hot glue guns, right? Anyways, they had another version of this with a different saying, but I like this one and I like the orange. So there we go. Then, ooh, there are more pumpkins. Cause you know, they, they have pumpkins and like school supplies. And the one, like the two things that Lara really loves like in this world is fall and, and supplies and like school supplies. So fall is my season. Season. Oh. <clears throat> I'm thirsty and I just have old coffee. Then I also found these pumpkins and I thought they were so pretty. So they've got this like little metally thing on here, but be careful, these do come off. Um, and so it's like this burnished looking, like bronzy, goldy color, like antique looking. And I thought these were so cute. So cute. And again, this one has been separated from its three other friends. So I also got this in a creamy color and another one of these, which you will see when I take that back out of my closet, out of my trunk. Not really the trunk, it's a back seat. Anyways. Then they have my old lady candy back. They had the Chico sticks back. I love these things. These are delicious. I already broke, broke into it. I had some the other day. They're so good. It's like... I don't know. I don't think they're like all over the place. Y'all ever had a Zagnut bar? If had a Zagnut, you know what I'm talking about? Mention it down below. I like, I think it's mostly regional because you get like Zagnuts and like Clark bars. It's more so like out of like Western Pennsylvania region, but Zagnut is the same thing as a Clark bar, except instead of having chocolate on the top, it has a toasted coconut and a Clark bar is a infinitely better version of Butterfinger, but still different. But you get the gist. It's like a peanut butterly crumbly, crumbly thing in there. So then they had these sunflower clips, sunflower clips, and it's just a giant sunflower with sequins. And you know I got it for the sequins with a clippy thing on it. Oh, maybe we can change out these succulents. Oh, I need to water that plant. Wait, this is too big. Oh, it's cute though. It looks like a little sunflower hat. Hmm, fascinating. Putting succulents and single flowers in planters. That's my version of the decor. Love it. Love it. All right, then I picked up, look, do I need more socks? No, I don't need socks. I can tell you, my feet get really cold. Like, my feet get really cold in the house. Like, and I don't remember having, like, this cold of feet before. And I don't know what it is. But I find, like, I constantly find myself, like, wearing fuzzy slippers or socks or something, like, throughout the house. Not for any reason other than my feet are cold as I'm sitting here fingering my feet right now. Oh, ew, ew, ew. Speaking of fingering feet, I had to go to the VW dealership yes, uh, Monday morning 
to get a recall. Um, there's a recall on my car. It was some sort of like sensor. And so I finally made the appointment and I went in there and I was sitting in the service area and there was this man and like we were all socially distanced and wearing masks and everything. But there was this man who kept taking off his sandals and putting his like bare feet up on his leg. And I was like, you know, if you can like socially distance and wear a mask, like maybe, maybe you keep your feet inside too. Like maybe you don't. And then and then he started to like finger in between his toes and I was like, but um like I don't know. I kinda think of that in the same like realm of things. Like you're trying to protect people from like your coughs and like your rona and all of that. And maybe you just protect us from like your your feet flying. Something. Anything. So Oh, this might be the other bag. Oh, sorry. <laughs> it's the other bag. Hey, look, it's the M. So this is the orange version of it. Now I can hold them all together. Yeah, boy. I know. Because I'm like, don't forget to subscribe. And you're like, girl, you don't even like organize your stuff, right? So this is what this looks like. So I got this and I don't really want the I mean, look, I'm gonna put this M up somewhere because whatever, but I really want the M and the other. No, it just went flying everywhere. Sorry okay then oh wait here's more in here son of a gun Laura oh no no anyways here is the um oh it's like ceramic -y. so here is the other version so I did get two of these and like I said watch out for the toppers because they do come off I did I do have it it's in a bag somewhere so I have those so I have two of these and two of these Organizing for crazy idea, isn't it? My garbage bag is over there. Okay, socks, socks. So I picked up a couple of pairs of socks and I'm going to put these in some friend mail because they were super cute and I want to share the sock love. But these are women's crew socks and they have avocado cat cat avocados yeah yeah avocados so we got some avocado cats with sunglasses look i get it dollar tree you're like there's there's like seven things that are really popular right now avocados cats sunglasses mermaids unicorns sloths and let's just put every combination of them on things donuts i get it i get it but you get these gems like avocados <laughs> <laughs> to go with it so I picked a pair of these these are nice you got two pairs of socks these are nice socks and then these ones here I also picked up and they are sloths they're little sloth socks so freaking cute again women's crew socks and the the complimentary pair they have are these ones here complimentary I, I mean they come with right but they also complement like color complimentary and then on the avocados there are there's pink and gray also Oh, God, I kill myself, don't I? I crack myself up. So, I love school supplies. I love school supplies. I love the thought of going back to school. Like, not actually going back to school, but, like, back to school. And, like, the shopping and the getting ready and, like, the new supplies. And, oh, God, I loved it. Anyways, they have some really, really, really stinking cute, like, school supplies at the DT. Would you look at this retro Game Boy pencil case. Would you look at that? And you know, it's just different enough that they can't be like, oh, that's my wedding light. And it's just different enough that they can't be like, oh, like you're infringing on like Nintendo's rights or whatever. Nope, it's not. It's a, so cute, dying. So I picked up one of those. And then look, 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 it's a, it's a Tyrannosaurus Rex on a bicycle. Again, dinosaurs are popular, bicycles are popular. Let's put them together on a pencil case. Dying, love those. So yeah, I had to pick those up. They're like, are you even like pencils? Nope, but I love pencil cases. Don't ask, just don't ask, okay? It's fine, it's fine, I'm fine, I'm fine. Moving on, I'll show you a couple more things. This here I picked up, I thought this was cute. Look, it's just a little, it's a little zipper purse. 
and it's a mermaid zipper purse but i got it from for morgan because it's red and the child loves red it's her favorite color so just a cute little zipper purse so she can put god knows what in there she's at that age where she likes putting stuff in stuff just i don't know she had my husband's like shoulder bag briefcasey thing and she had a picnic in there she had a stuffed on a doll in there she had a she had a tea towel just carrying it all over the place it's fine it's fine then a couple more things so i picked up this notebook so cute look, would you look at this it says follow your dreams and it's look at this well first of all the background is black awesome right and then this like holographic flowers could you die could you die this is so pretty oh so pretty so funny my team makes fun of me for like paper i'm like let me get my note and they're like why are you using notes i'm like shush and this is unlined it's unlined which is fine you can follow your dreams but you don't have to follow the lines i love it about. then i picked up a photo album i actually picked up two photo albums at the dollar tree the other day because um, Morgan and I printed out some pictures that I had taken and I started putting them, I printed out like 33 pictures and then I started putting them in the thing and in the, in the photo album and then I ran out of pages. Like, it may only have 25. I'm like, oh my God, the photo album only has space for 25 pictures. So this one has 48 slots in it. So I picked up that to put more pictures in. And then the last thing I'm gonna show you is it is a 2001 weekly planner and it's a weekly page format. It is glitter. It says every day is a new day and it has like week by week, a little bit of something, something to write down. This is going in friend mail and I'll tell you why. I do not use a planner. I have come to the realization with myself that no matter how many planners you purchase, no matter how pretty they are, no matter how many pretty pens that you buy to write in them, you're not gonna write it down. You're gonna live off the electronic calendar in your phone and on Outlook. That's it. You're not gonna write it down anywhere. You're just not, because then it's another place to write it down. Don't. So, but it's so pretty. It's so pretty. So yeah, so I picked up one of these. Loved it. Loved it. Not gonna use it. And it's important, like when you reach a certain age, you come to that like realization about yourself. You're like, I love this and this is beautiful, but I want somebody else to use it because I know that I will not. So if you've made it this far, thank you. Thank you for making it through. This is gonna be like a weird vibed video. So, anyways. If you are not a subscriber, please consider doing so. We are on the March, March, March to a thousand subscribers, which is crazy. Oh my God. There are so many things you could be doing and you are watching 18 minutes of me. And I thank you for that. So thank you so much. Y'all are amazing. Um, so yeah, please hit that like button, the subscribe button. That'd be super duper awesome. Um, and I hope everybody's staying safe and sane and healthy and I will see y'all soon.